you've been with Jay Z since the beginning, right? So I mean, yeah, for about what, ten, fifteen years. What's now. it like working with Jay Z? What's he? What's he like? I mean, he's the best at what he does. So you know, it's like working with greatness. I'm working with a living legend. You yeah. Know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's cool. You know, he's very diligent and he does his work correct and uh, he's a classy dude. Yeah. yeah. Now, how did you? How'd you guys started this as a record company initially, or were? Well, no, I was his manager. I was a manager a long time ago, about 10, 10 12 years ago, and uh. I didn't like the way the record companies were treating us, and then when I got with Jay as a manager, they were telling me that uh, he wasn't as good as he was, and they were telling me how to rap about our personal experiences. And it just didn't seem to make uh, good good money sense. I couldn't, I didn't see how they should make more money than us. So we put it together, I learned how to market, and uh, the rest was history. Me and, my, me and my partner Biggs, Jay, put it together, and we just uh, you know, sold some records. You've been in a lot of the Jay-Z videos though, right? Yeah, I like to dance. Yeah, you dance in a lot of the videos? I mean, you know, being in it's real, and uh, when Jay-Z's music comes on, I tend to get busy, you yeah. know what I'm saying? So, you know, we like, it to, we like to keep it as real as possible, so it's just truthful. When I like, I like his music, so, yeah. yeah. Do people recognize you a lot from that, or they just know you now from, from being uh, Damon Dash? Well, Dash rhymes with cash, too. That's kind of cool, right? Yeah, it's, it's closely related. related. It's, it's Cash's cousin. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, I think Big Pepper really got me seen a lot, but uh, it used to bother me that people related me to getting drunk and being on, you know, in videos rather than being the best businessman that ever did it. Mm -hmm. So, you know, a couple years ago was the videos, but now that I'm starting to, like, talk more about my different businesses and I've been successful for so long, people are starting to know me more for uh, being you know, super businessman. Right, and you're directing movies and all this stuff. Yeah, directing, producing. I didn't like my experience with the major la major companies. You know, I did this movie, Paid in Full. I don't wanna really say any names, you know, but it was Dimension. I didn't like the way they uh, carried the movie. Right. So, you know, I felt like I would never be put myself in that position again where someone controlled my destiny. So I had to learn how to direct, produce, act, executive produce, distribute. So I wanna have my own, you know, movie studio, Dash Films and Rockefeller Films, because no one will ever tell me what to do again. And plus I make good movies. If you want to see a fire clip from a young Les Brown, check out the video right there next to me. I think you'll enjoy it. Continue to believe, and I'll see you there. It's hard changing your life. It was hard when just over three years ago in the Penobscot building in Detroit, Michigan,